All right, guys, so yes, me and James looked at the N64 version of Glover in the previous episode, so let's look at the PlayStation version, which was released a year after this one, after the Nintendo 64 version. And what I can say is, is it should have just stayed on the Nintendo 64 and PC because this version sucks. That bad. Yeah. Uh, at least we get a nice little um, picture of Glover. Yeah. Then we get the Atari logo. There you go. Pong, Centipede, Missile Command, Cuba, Next Tetris, and Glover. All the six games part of the Atari lineup from Hasbro. Why did they even put this under the Atari name? It's not even an arcade game. It's just a 3D platformer. I have no idea. Yeah. And here is the intro. This is different to the N64 and PC versions. And for some reason it's very quiet. Yeah. Starting off in a good start. And there's, I think that's Glover's brother shaking up that green potion. There's the crystals and on the castle. So what would you think of this, of the intro so far? Not too bad, I mean, it's PS1, but it does look too bad for PS1. Yeah. That's Glover's brother on um, the wizard's hand, and Glover's on that side. And then... Disaster strikes. When the gloves falls into the potion, Glover flies out, the wizard explodes. Well, we actually turned into a statue. Then. And then after this. Psh, there's cross stitch. Made by, from the bad potion. So that's how it happens. Yes. But in the N64 version, it was purely by accident. But in this version, it appears that the other glove did it deliberately. There's four languages, but we're selecting English. So start options and high scores. Load game, because I've already got, I've already played through this. So there we go. So this game is purely different to the um, other versions of the game. Well, for some reason, the world just looks okay. Well, there's no red fog, which is less yeah. creepy. Yeah. yeah, and the music in my copy of the game um, lags a lot. Well, here mainly. Sometimes, um, just trying to find the first world of the... Oh, just ignore that, it's just me. The music's lagging. Oh, yeah. That's... Okay, that's one bad thing. Yeah, but that's because it's my um, copy. My copy plays up. Uh, I might quickly turn it off before I get into the into one of the worlds. Oh. There we go. That's the Atlantis world, I think, which is the first world of the game. What would you think of um, the PS1 version to the N64 version? Do you think it doesn't look as good as the, um... Well, yeah, not as good. Yeah. The music's the same as the PC version. But yeah, when you replay levels, um, the ball doesn't get saved. Um, unlike when you play these for the first time. And luckily enough, Glover doesn't have that scream that, that he does in the um, N64 version. Thank goodness for that. Because I've actually accidentally destroyed the crystal before. I don't think Glover makes any noise when um, the crystal is, gets broken. Hmm. That? 
Music is good. I've heard that sound effect before when you um go in and the water goes into the water. Oh, it, uh, it's from another Hasbro Interactive title. I've heard that sound effect. Rollercus the Tycoon 1. So... Okay, so... Let me just... Oops. But at least um, you can turn the you can turn the um, controls off. But um, at least it um, at least you can. Um, yeah. For some reason L two doesn't work at all. Yeah, I tried doing that earlier, but it didn't seem to want to respond. See, I think my DualShock two doesn't. Um, Oh, that it was pretty glitchy. Oh. Weird. It's not responding, is it? No. I got, I got scanned with that controller. I must make sure not to press the um. There we go. I think I know what to do here. That's what I need to do. Destroy the things. So... There we go. It's lucky that the um, crystal can float in water. Oh, I destroyed the crystal. Oh dear. But at least there wasn't that yeah. horrible scream. Oh, you're looking at a um, Lego video. Yes. Lego Toy Story. Yeah. This is basically it's to showcase all the mini figures that are released for the theme. Okay. All the related characters. Yes. Yeah. Did you end up owning any of the sets? Unfortunately not. Um, I wonder if um, that... Which um, YouTube is that, Maniac for Bricks? Um, it's Brick Vault. Okay. Um, I wonder if um, you've seen any of the... Um, any reviews for the Island Extreme stunt sets? I think I have yet. Because um, you've already seen um, the three I have. Let me just... There we go. Let's get the ball out. We've got the aliens. Yeah. They made um they made them um, a version a new version of Buzz Lightyear with a me figure head in the Yeah, in the regular Disney one. The Disney collectible minifigures. I really wanted them. I really want the Mickey Mouse figure. Yeah. But unfortunately, I never got it. Should have um, liked Lego at the time, or that means I could finally get a Mickey. So let's just complete the level. We are at the end. Yeah, of the first level. Yeah, the levels are quite short, but there is a lot of stuff that they add into them. Hmm. 
There we go, that's the first level done of this uh, new... See you guys next time, I guess. Bye. Bye.